Hi, this is Tarot Reader. This is a love, lust, sex tarot reading for the zodiac sign of Libra. The timeline for this reading is 1st of December 2022 till 31st of March 2023. Now, I see a lot of intense relationships in the coming months, okay? Relationships which are intense, which have a dose of sadomasochistic pleasures, relationships where you are trying to be very stubborn, and even the partner or the sexual character you're getting involved with is, is an equally stubborn soul, okay? But you have pretty interesting events because you're going to connect with someone who's almost like a soulmate for you but it's but whether it's a libra man or a libra woman the soulmate is someone who is who's there in your life for a short period the relationship is intense because this person is letting you discover certain aspects of your own sexual life which you haven't experienced before this person is making you uh, you know far more selfish when it comes to your needs because his or her entry in your life it creates that desire to possess this person, that desire inside you to possess this person for as long as you can or forever for that matter. Yeah, so uh, there is going to be a lot of extreme emotions that you're going to go through, a turmoil in your emotional life. But sometimes, you know, you need that chaos. You need uh, 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 the circumstances in such a way when when you know life shrugs you you need that 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 volcanic effect because somewhere uh, that chaos that 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 upheaval helps you accept things the way they are and when you are over it you actually feel a lot more better i could be wrong i'm just reading what i'm saying but i do go wrong because as a reader i, I am prone to errors i am uh, incapable at times in my work i'll be very honest okay um, this one person i see especially for the libra woman i see a man he's very masculine very charming okay his build is far more attractive than his face he's conventional looking broad forehead or a bald head big eyes not typically handsome but very masculine the the, the face re reveals a very athletic and a masculine and a ruthless uh, aura Okay, but somewhere you're you're completely crazy because the more you meet him, the more you see him, the more you get involved with him, the craze, the obsession is increasing day by day. Okay, this guy is extremely ruthless. He is not willing to accept that he's attached to you. He's not willing to accept that you are a part of his life in some way, that both of you are habituated or addicted to each other. Okay, but you need to be very careful because his ego is massive. He could be in litigation issues. If his mother is alive, then she is a very cunning woman and she's the reason why his personal life has been what it is whether it's the relation with his wife if he's married or the or the relation with his girlfriends even if he's single in the past everything has been affected by his mother you need to be very careful or could be an elderly sister who is very manipulative and very shameless this guy is also a lot into occult stuff okay the, the look in his eyes will tell you he's someone who can be also into spirit work or he might be connecting with the dead spirit <coughs> excuse me so there is a lot of occult energy in the background but you have a very strong karmic connection with this man try and avoid any verbal uh, argument with him okay when he becomes toxic in his behavior you need to give it a break don't keep sending him messages don't keep arguing with him on the messages it's not going to help you it's only going to make because see end of the day you know that this man is a part of your life right now you want him badly you can't let him go and if you try to be rude to him or you try to vent your anger on him he'll be equally vindictive towards you and that will hurt you more or he'll try not to meet you for a few days even that will make things more painful for you so uh, any argument needs to be avoided for your own peace of mind or for your own uh, pleasure or happiness whatever you call it as he's a little bit extre uh, extreme and unconventional in his sexual traits okay or he's someone who's way too adventurous in passion and sometimes it can be very painful so you need to be careful if you have any health condition then you make it very clear with him that he's not supposed to trouble you in that area okay uh, travel is there there's a possibility you might go out on a short vacation with this person especially the libra woman okay you might go on a short vacation with him and there is passion but he might end up flirting with some other girls over there which you cannot stop you have to accept it as it is some people we cannot control we cannot expect uh, a hundred percent loyalty from them i'm sorry i'm saying this because it's very difficult to control someone else 
okay so um, wh whether my reading is accurate inaccurate I, I i wouldn't know but i know i do make errors but one thing is generic i'm sure everyone knows anyone who's not a kid and an adult or has crossed 18 years of age you realize at after a point in life you can't control anyone whether it's a known person, whether it's within your family, whether it's someone outside, somewhere or the other, it's 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 there will be a phase where you are helpless and you can't really control someone. So you need to accept that with this guy. For the Libra man, you you have travels related to work or travel related to a litigation issue, because of which you're going to connect with a girl who's much younger to you in a different location. It's going to be a short sexual passion phase and it's giving you a lot of intensity the girl is much younger so the energy level is high she's kiddish she's childish at times at times she can be very very possessive but you're enjoying that drama you're actually enjoying the entire level of energy uh, if you've started recently working out or going to the gym don't leave it halfway because somewhere that fitness thing is going to get on to you okay but if you're not drinking sufficient water or you need skin treatments please get it done for the libra woman be careful with your navel area okay uh, any skin issues any any uh, uterus issues also get them treated and checked okay and even with any any infection of the ear or the any problems with the spine you need to be careful uh, for the libra woman okay if you need to go for any chemical or laser treatments for the skin or any treatments for the eye please go ahead maybe the coming months are suitable for that you are getting pretty good doctors you're getting pretty good treatments you might even get some discounts on the treatments which might work for you for the libra woman i see you connecting with a lot of men through work and you'll be able to see that intensity or lust in their eyes these are acquaintances who have desires for you i'm not saying you you're not supposed to get involved you go ahead but you let the man make the move and you you be smart enough to know first i know the traits or the behavior pattern of every man before you actually uh, get close to them or you allow them to come close to you one is a man is elder ruthless someone from a government or a political background very powerful very adamant but if you're getting close to this man he can be very controlling to the point he can suffocate you so you need to be cautious over there there's another man he's from a different location emotional affluent stingy clingy he's he's a, he's like a child a two-year-old kid he, if he wants something he wants it and he can even hold grudges against people for silly reasons but if when he's helping you whether you even if you're not in a relation with him or you're not even sexually involved with him even then he's a man who will help you in bad times so at least ensure that you're uh acquaintance or your, your normal equation with him is on friendly terms because he is a very resourceful contact for you yeah whether you get involved with him or no you need to maintain the equation with him at least yeah there's one more man he's from a different location very rude very arrogant sometimes over the top okay he's not a very social soul and people don't really like him much in the in the society okay maybe because of his skill sets or his work people tolerate him but otherwise he's someone who's actually been ostracized by society he's helping you a lot okay there are certain things he's going to tell you or warn you against and you're going to make use of it yeah he's not a relationship material he's not even worthy of a sexual fling but you need to be in touch with him you need to ensure that you have a good equation a cordial equation with this man because he is an important resource for you you're going to connect with a lot of people on the internet so for the libra women who are not on dating apps who are not on social media and you're looking for someone are you looking for passion and happiness in your life go out join join the dating app join a uh, uh, social media platform but ensure for dating apps you go for the ones which where you have those prof paid profiles where you pay for a subscription so that a profile is far more safer because you're a girl then you need to be careful that you don't get unwanted uh, nuisance also right so try to go for a paid one and and unless and until you haven't done a video call or you haven't verified that character person in on a video call or something don't exchange personal numbers be very careful you might invite a lot of negative stuff also but that doesn't mean you are not supposed to go on to those platforms because sometimes you need to look for characters outside your comfort zone for that little bit of happiness and that's that 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 risk you need to take at times i could be wrong do it as per your discretion 
if you're adamant on a particular decision in your personal or professional life which is getting a lot of negativity or a lot of uh, enemies around you you need to change that decision or you need to keep it on hold for some time for the libra man uh, you cannot expect some girls to be uh, you know uh, nice or cordial to other people around you they can be temperamental so when you know someone is temperamental try to meet that person alone rather than in, in, in a public public sphere to to avoid embarrassment yeah stomach issues please be careful with okay and uh, libra man uh, be careful with your hygiene yeah especially your feet yeah it shouldn't happen that your hygiene drives someone away from you yeah because you're charming your cards are pretty charming the way you are okay charming masculine everything is there but uh, hygiene shouldn't drive someone away yeah uh the libra woman if you are careful about your uh, the skin on your feet ensure it's well moisturized okay and usually the the kind of cards you've drawn a layering of clothes in in a cold climate will also help you in your relationships in some way yes and uh, try to wear a lot of blacks purples and dark blues okay at least a strong dark blue or dark purple in your clothing that will help you in some way or the other yes yeah and uh, if you and uh, clothing any color whatever is your favorite but if you if you're someone who's heavily into scarves and stoles and all then ensure that those are in strong pigmented colors strong solid colors okay not necessarily the pastels yeah um and try and ensure that you apply a little bit of perfume or perfumed oil on your navel for the libra woman yes for the libra man if you're someone who's heavily into smoking and all that okay ensure that you use a very strong musky fragrance or a spicy fragrance that will uh, help you attract more uh, female partners yeah for uh, those of you in the in the libra zodiac who are into alternative sexuality you're going to meet someone who's pretty interesting okay whether you're looking for a male partner or a female partner but this person is very interesting someone who's actually meant for you because there's a karmic connection coming your way uh, just remember that you can't look at this person for the long term this is a short fling but it's a very fulfilling uh, experience okay just ensure that you are in touch with them when you try and meet them more rather than do electronic chats okay and don't don't do too much of texting or chatting that might backfire yeah and those who are into alternative sexuality in the libra with a libra men of women you need to ensure that you wear a uh, dark red or dark purple in a wear on tuesdays fridays and saturdays and if possible wear a diamond on your body libra women anywhere uh, okay whether you are straight or into alternative sexuality please wear a diamond yeah that will not only enhance your beauty but all it will also help you with your uterus health Yes, a diamond of at least one one and a half carats. If you can't afford a full fledged one piece diamond, then buy it in bits and pieces, like thirty cents, forty cents, and just ensure the total weight weight of the diamond on your body is at least one one and a half carat. Yeah. I hope I have not offended you. Yeah. Thank you. Blessed be. Thank you.